Hi Pisces, welcome to your love reading for May 2023. This is going to be for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Venus and Rising. This is Feline Intuition Tarot. Let's see what's coming up for you when it comes to love. Okay, we got home, social media. Some of you may be starting social media business from home. We got single and dates. Some of you may be working from home on social media, maybe um, starting something. If you're single, there's a date coming up in May. Let's see, what do we have? Hmm. Spiritual cleanse, okay. Run the course, oh my gosh. This card is coming up for every sign. We have to be loved. Equal excitement regarding a love connection. So yeah, for you Pisces with the run the course, if you're going through a spiritual cleanse, you know it's rough on the body, on the mind, on the emotions. So yeah, it's saying run the course, just like what it said for the other signs. Um, it's not gonna be easy. You got dirty laundry, so I feel like there's people gossiping as well. Let's see what we have. Pisces and the person they're currently thinking about. What's the energy gonna be between these two for May 2023? Someone feels really rejected by you. You could be angry at this person or upset with them, done with them even, with the King of Wands in reverse. Definitely there's been some kind of switch up. There's definitely been conflict between you two. I see that you're de deciding not to put up with this person anymore. So they're feeling rejected, I guess. They're going to be running back to you. I keep seeing this theme, especially when the run the course card comes out. It's like you're cleansing and healing. Some of you are doing cord cutting and it's causing the people in your life. Like it's causing you to see the truth about the people who you once wanted in your life, who you were once chasing. Like you're going to start to see that they're actually having a hard time letting you go and that you never had to chase them. Um, they are stuck on the past with you. Like, I see you just getting fed up and leaving a situation behind that wasn't serving you and actually realizing that this person is deeply missing you. Some of you are even blocking them, cutting off communication, or you're just fed up with how the communication is. What do we have for Pisces? What are the love messages for Pisces for the month of May? What's we have for Pisces? Could be dealing with a Cancer, a Taurus, a Capricorn, Pisces. <laughs> um, yep, those are the main signs. This person. We are just here. I just heard a sound. <laughs> Never mind. This person, um, they feel unstable and they, they're not sure how they feel about you because they're not sure what you're doing at the moment when it comes to them. They see you as taking a break. They see you as a four of swords. So you're not really making any moves. So they're kind of confused. Why the moon? Why is there moon in their feelings? Yeah, they feel like you've just dropped them. They're confused. They're in a state of confusion. They're watching your page as well. They want to communicate. Uh, clarify this dirty laundry card. What's going on with this for Pisces? What's going on with the dirty laundry? Some of you have new love. People are going to be gossiping. Or there's someone who wants to give you a love offer. And I feel like some of, some of you people are going to witness your ex really chasing you. And people are going to be like, wow. Like, they really miss Pisces, but it's something about you not putting up with their inconsistencies. Why the Queen of Pentacles in reverse? Yeah, there's conflict between you two. They're getting really agitated, really um, worried. Some of you, they may feel like you're moving on quickly or you could move on quickly. Why the Nine of Cups? 
you're in this nine of cups energy a lot of you are definitely fulfilling your own wishes focusing on stabilizing yourself and there could be someone coming in like i said to connect with you they have some kind of stable offer for you there's someone who you've seen in a really good light so there could be someone else in the picture for you someone new coming in in may why the chariot Something about you knowing your worth here. The star in reverse as well. Realizing that you are not being treated the way you are supposed to be. Moving forward, moving on. Why the magician? King of Cups. So you got your eyes on someone. Chariot again, upright. You have caught someone's eye or someone's caught your eye and you're just heading in their direction. I don't know if they're asking you on a date, they're pursuing you properly the way they're supposed to. Um, or let's say you date women and you're pursuing her and she's receiving well, being receptive to your to your love. Okay. Um, something about that. Some some of you are really into somebody. Verify the Knight of Wands, please. Okay, so I do feel like there, this ex or an ex or some people from your past could be gossiping. Queen of Wands in reverse. That's my gossiping card. We also have the King of Wands in reverse. There are some people who are angry. There's some angry. That's what the dirty laundry is about. People are angry. Maybe they see you getting this really good treatment, this love offer. They don't like it. Clarify the, the page of swords, please. moving on to great things queen of swords five of swords in reverse you put your foot down here definitely moving on because you see this wheel of fortune you see how the wheel can turn for you if you make better choices in love similar to the air signs pisces i see you just going for it like seeing the light at the end of the tunnel and just running because you see what your outcome is going to be if you choose correctly if you run the course Cleanse your energy, attract new types of people and things. What's the love message for Pisces? Fear of failure. Trust. Give plus receive and lessons learned. This is what you want. Equal give and take. I feel like that's what you're running towards. Trust in the universe. You may have a little bit of fear that, that you could fail, but definitely keep the faith because i'm seeing the light at the end of the tunnel for you as you see equal excitement regarding the connection so it's like you're coming in contact with someone who is giving you that equal you've stopped accepting bare minimum from people you're deciding i'm going to only go where i'm being loved you know receiving as well clarify sorry not clarify what are the messages for pisces for me connection follow your heart exactly passion and deja vu so the past people of course are going to want to repeat things with you they're going to want to repeat things with you this past person feels like they have to compete for you they may try to compete for you If you didn't mean it, inconsistencies. We will overcome this. I feel like the past person is gonna try. Like they're gonna try. I don't know if this that. I don't know if you're gonna make it work with them. We have. There will be a return. I knew this was coming. So we will overcome this. But the thing about them is the inconsistencies. I feel like that's what you're turning away from. But I definitely see them fighting for this because they feel this feeling of instability. But they're fighting for it too late. What, what's the advice for Pisces? Think twice. 
you are being highly thought of step into the unknown and fulfilling outcomes so you see what i mean they're thinking of you highly now but you're deciding to step into the unknown you're like i don't know what's next but i'm gonna wait and see because sick of this these one-sided relationships and then you end up with a fulfilling outcome and it's like some of you it may happen quick i feel like it could happen for you pisces quicker than the other signs i don't know why i'm seeing that but it's saying thing twice about the past person they're thinking of you highly but remember like um i'm oh my god i'm stuttering they don't want me to say it <laughs> emotionally uninvolved people only want you when they can't have you okay so yeah they're gonna think of you highly when they can't have you then you take them back and it's back to the same old lame old behavior one-sided relationship answering you when they feel like it showing up when they feel like it because when you when you become emotionally available they become unavailable because they don't want someone who's available i said this in one of the collectives it's the collective channel is linked in the description box below but i spoke about this because it came up about past people all of a sudden wanting to fight for you because you're no longer available so why are they seeing pisces as the four of swords because you're rejecting them ace of wands in reverse exactly you are not accepting what they're offering anymore it's not enough it's not enough one-sided relationships are not enough you want this give plus receive thank you you are trusting the universe and stepping into the unknown and trusting that the universe will give you what you're asking for your energy in the past may have been attracting these unemotional sorry emotionally unavailable people you making that sacrifice to say okay i'm gonna say no to this and not accept lower or less than i deserve is what's bringing in this lover's energy and this person or these people now that you don't want them they're into you because they only want what they can't have so this is what i'm seeing for you pisces this there's definitely someone that you're seeing i don't know if it's, a lot of you may already know who this is because you're seeing someone as a magician the king of cups is someone who is fully like knows what to do knows what to do in a relationship knows how to love is emotionally available they are coming towards you with caution as well maybe they've gone through what you've gone through maybe they've also healed maybe they used to attract um emotionally unevolved i wasn't even meant to say emotionally unevolved <laughs> i was most i was meant to say emotionally unavailable but yeah that too emotionally unavailable unevolved people they used to attract they had to heal from this too so they're coming at you like are you emotionally available or are you the same people from my past so pisces i feel for you more than the other signs you're definitely coming in contact with someone more quickly that is just that just catches your eye they're giving you they're giving because you know pisces you're the, you're always the giving one you're actually you're actually receiving in this connection so you're like oh my god the universe is actually the universe actually came through so you'll know you know so i hope this was helpful you could be dealing with a cancer pisces cancer scorpio um gemini Aquarius, Leo, Pisces, Capricorn. So I hope this was helpful. Subscribe if you're new. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.